Okay, quick video on how to change line types and whatnot in CAD for showing hidden detail and that kind of thing. Let's say we had a line going across here. Um, I went a bit off kilter then. I'll just trim uh, TR enter. Just select everything, press enter. Uh, oh, sorry, I didn't do that in TR enter. I'll click that line, press enter. And then click that. We want to make that like hidden or dashed. Um, you can uh, just click this drop down here, but usually we've only got a couple of choices. We want another choice. And we're going to have to load in, I'll click load, <coughs> and we'll go down to, I'll type D for dashed. We'll use this dashed one here. There are several types. Click OK. Um, click OK again. I'll click that, and I'll t now it'll be available in here as dashed. So you can see it's changed to a dashed line. You can choose one of the other line types, or um, just double click it. Um, in fact, don't double click, press escape, just type PR uh, for properties and then click it. And in here you can change the line type scale. Usually that's set to the scale that you're using on your uh, in your layout one and your paper space. That's If I double click in here, whatever your viewport's set to, it's usually set to that. Um, but you can change it, I suppose, if need be, let's change that to 2. So it's just got twice as big. Change it to 0 0.5 then and it'll make it a bit more uh, refined like this so you can change it for an individual line whatever if you wanted to change that have that effect on everything globally you type LT scale and then change that from 1 to 0 0.5 and that all change uh, to being to being twice as frequent that kind of thing but usually you can just set it per line type um, so I'll just remind you again click that from the drop down if it's not there choose other and load another one in, so I'll type C this time for center line. That's okay. Okay, that. So I'll select my line and select uh, center line this time. You can see it's changed to a dot dash type line style. Double click that, won't work. I have to type PR properties. Click that and change that to, well, I don't know, one. So you can see how that looks. It's large because it's such a tiny shape that I'm doing. Let's change that to 0.25. Um, that's a bit better. <clears throat> there you go, that would of course would then be on its own layer I haven't set one up <clears throat> but you could put it on your dimensions layer if you like or whatever you'd never have a centre line shown like that we're, we're, I'm trying to show you hidden detail I'm just showing you how to try and you know how to change it hidden detail would be shown like this you'd have another layer I'll just type LA enter um, called hidden uh, so we'll call it hidden give it a colour we'll say magenta this time so it's thinner than uh, black so on here, I'd set, click that and set that to the hidden layer. Um, you know, that, that's it, pretty much how you set um, line types in CAD.